Lydia, Priestess Honeymoon. Mm -mm -mm. Mm, just feeling all the feels right now. <laughs> Wrapping myself in this blanket and just soaking them all in. And just at that place of peace, joy, and bliss. Peace, bliss, joy? <laughs> Does it matter? The order. Oh, just giving myself so much love and I feel a little hungover. <laughs> That might be why else I'm just sitting and just being quiet and feeling all of whatever's here. <laughs> yeah, just not. Oh, I felt like I was in this other world, other dimension, or like lost in time, just being so present to it all. <laughs> such a beautiful place to be I feel like the just limitless possibilities here hmm. Hmm. yeah wow hmm. I just found this beautiful bear bliss community and Ona oh no <laughs> Nat naturist community and went to this board games and the buff and clothing optional event and just yeah really glad I did and followed the call to go I was just so kind of scared to go but I was also excited you know fear and excitement or the same feeling in the body it's just like what we put on it you know and really challenging myself and all of my beliefs about what that is and really just wanting to be comfortable in my own skin and especially I feel like on this path of you know sacred sexuality and really feeling the priestess path and the pleasure that we need to be experiencing more pleasure, but also still having guilt and shame trapped in my womb and in my body. And just, I feel like however much we work through, there will still be some there from the way we've been conditioned for just thousands of years since the beginning of this humanity. And I feel so connected to the star beings and feel that energy in me really being released and knowing that our sexuality is the key to the bringing this way back to us of really being so comfortable in our own skin too and I, so I really felt called to go and just yeah, be comfortable being naked around people and just and not having it be about sex. And just having that comfort and yeah, I remember like my family was pretty like we would they would be skinny dipping at this rock. I went with a friend, I guess around grade seven or eight, or maybe maybe younger, maybe like six or five, grade five. And people were skinny dipping and my friend, like we were already self-conscious, you know, about our bodies and not wanting to, to be naked around, around people. And that was around my family. So, I mean, <sighs> wow, I'm just <laughs> reclaiming all of me being comfortable, just expressing my truest self out. And yeah, I just love this place where I'm at, where however I show up in any moment is just perfectly me and just 
gracefully accepting it. <laughs> now I need to get to work. <laughs> watching time, or not watching time, but just being in this place separate from time, or just lost in time, and so present to the moment, but I'm also wanting to get a few things done, so... <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna do those things now and just ah, uh, hmm. so so grateful for where I'm at, just fully loving and expressing myself and forgiving myself. Going deeper into myself, but also coming out of that place and just living in the moment. And <laughs> mm, wanting to just explore my relationships and develop new friendships. And yeah, there's so much we can learn from in relationships. So I'm excited. <laughs> for that <laughs> and everything else in life la 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 mwah, mwah, mwah. peace and love have a beautiful day <laughs>